What's up, my Geminis? How my air signs doing? I hope you all is well. It's me, K-Star, for those of you who don't know me. Listen, I've been trying to um, upload videos and I'm having issues with um, YouTube. So, with that being said, um, if you guys see some videos that's... Because some, some of the videos I... Um, set the date on there. So it's not the fact that it's late. It's been sitting there I've been trying to upload for like the past three or four days. But I'm hoping that this works um, When I do this, but basically Gemini this message is going to be um, a reading about what are your ex thinking of you this weekend? About the situation and possibly how do you feel about this person? Would you take them back or are you just moving right along? Okay, so that's what this reading is gonna be about um, try to make it short and sweet and also, too, for those of you who like to leave a donation, the, inf the information and, or personal reading, the information will be right below the video. Um, so we're going to do the disclaimer. If the shoe fits, wear that shit. And if it doesn't apply, let it fly. Okay, don't try to get in where you don't fit in. There's other tarot readers that's here that um, who could possibly have your message or, you know, just check the chart. Okay. Um, what else I was going to say? I can't remember. But, yeah, this is going to be for your ex. Okay, what is your ex thinking about this weekend of you? Okay, so let's get it popping. Let's see what's going on with the X Files. Okay, mm, the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this ex wants to give you a grand apology, possibly a proposal, because they see they bit the head that, that they bit the hand that fed them. They see, do you see that eye in the center of that pentagram? Okay. So, they want new beginnings with you. Gemini, let's see what else is going on. Yep, the Ten of Cups here. Gemini, <laughs> your ex is still in love with you. They are visualizing a family coming back to try to make it right. Or, the, or this could possibly be Gemini, some kind of way they see you being happy. Look here, the five of wands here in reverse. They don't want any conflict. I feel like they're going to give you an offer. I think there's going to be a proposal here, an apology here. Okay, some things going to come to light. You know, they're going to try to come in and make this, this to wipe this slate clean, I feel, Gemini. Okay. Um, anything that you were arguing with them before in the past, possibly third-party situations, or y'all just clash and had different views, this person is going to come in and just going to tell you that they are sorry because they see the shortcomings that they have. The Nine of Swords here, they're in their heads about you, Gemini. Okay? So you could be dealing with an earth sign, fire sign, or even water sign here. They're in their head about you. Okay? Um, the Three of Cups here in reverse. Um, I feel like that person that they were cheating on you with, they're no longer with that individual. You're not even thinking about that person anymore. You're the one that they want. This could possibly be here too with these two here, the Three of Cups here and the Nine of Swords here, that they are totally mind-fucked and depressed. Okay, their thoughts are really foggy. They can't help but to not think about you. Um, possibly having massive headaches. They possibly suffer, suffer from headaches. Okay, this person don't even go out and party like they used to. Now, I'm wondering if I should take this. Let's do this over. What came out was the Seven of Swords. Okay. Okay, so the Wheel of Fortune here in reverse. Feeling incomplete without you. Karma is really bad when it comes down to them. Um, things are not moving forward. That's what I'm getting here. They want to give you a grand offering. I feel like it's a proposal. Yep, here it is. The Queen of Wands here. Okay, let's see what Kipper has to say. I feel like this person was possibly trying to keep themselves busy and not to even think about you. It's not working. They're gonna come in, they're gonna apologize. Occupation, okay. Holy Spirit, please clarify the Ace of Swords. They're gonna work on the occupation card, flew out. Please clarify the Ace of Pentacles here for my Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising, and in Venus. My Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. What is their ex thinking? Okay, yep, thoughts. 
You see that? I think they're going to, believe it or not, this person going to come clear out of the blue and they're going to try to propose to you. They're going to want to propose to you. They have the proposal on their mind. Okay? Holy Spirit, please clarify the Ten of Cups here. For Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Change. They, they're going to come in. If this person wants to change their ways, what is it saying? The house. Yep. They want to change how they went about things. I'm doing how they went about what they did before. They're saying to themselves, you know, I would never do this again. I would never do this to him or her again. I hope they accept this offer that I'm going to give to them because I'm going to apologize. This person is possibly the type of person who was never the type of person who apologized, but they're going to do it this time. Okay, Holy Spirit, please clarify the five of wands here. Just keep popping out. The five of wands here in reverse for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. The gift. I'm going to tell you something. Somebody's going to be fucked up that y'all two back together again. It's going to get this person in the bad head space too as well. Yes. Someone is not going to like this. This could be the third party situation, but somebody... It's not going to like the thought of your ex coming back to you and giving you the gift. I feel like this gift is going to be a ring. Okay. Holy Spirit, please clarify the nine of swords. Yep. Concern. You're in heavy thoughts. They wake up thinking about you. Got a mature woman. Could it be a possibility, um, Gemini, that maybe a lot of this stuff did not go on right because um, the person that you were with, the mature woman came out and gave me a sense of a mother energy who possibly did not like you, okay? And that could have possibly messed up this relation to, relationship up as well. Mother possibly was aware of um, the third-party situations, okay? Holy Spirit, please clarify the three of cups here in reverse. Why am I hearing brain tumor? The mature woman came out again. I feel like this woman, I don't think this is you, Gemini. I think that, I think that there's a mother figure here who's a fucking bitch. Excuse me. She's giving me this. I'm getting angry just thinking about it. Somebody need to go get a CAT scan or MRI done because they're having massive headaches. Holy Spirit, please clarify the will of fortune here in reverse. The wealthy man here so he doesn't feel too in reverse. He does not feel too uh, confident. He's feeling down on himself. Holy Spirit, please clarify the Queen of Wands here. Who is this Queen of Wands? I don't know if I'm supposed to take this. But Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Queen of Wands here. Courtship. Did I not tell you? He's going to take action. Someone don't like the fact that this person, that your ex is going to come back and give you this offering. I think it's the mother. I think it's the mother here. Concern. Let me see. Holy Spirit, give me three more cards here for Gemini. I almost said cancer. I don't know if any of you are dealing with the cancer. Change. Give me three more cards here for Gemini. Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. Three cards here. Dog, loyalty. This person gonna come back and be loyal to you. The book here in reverse. And the cross. I feel like they're gonna come in and be loyal to you. Let me see something for a second. Um... What I want to see is, let me clarify the concern card in the Nine of Swords here. I'm seeing with the dog in the book in reverse, they're not going to rewrite the same story. This person, when they're coming this time, they're going to come in with loyalty. That's what I'm getting. But this bitch. Okay. That's your problem right there. Well, really and truly, it's not your problem unless you make it the problem. 
someone has a headache that they're gonna give you this offer. I feel like it's them, it's the mother. Some mature woman, some older woman who do not like you, okay? And I feel like with this concern card and this nine of swords here, it's concerning. They just don't fucking like you. Like, it's a fucking headache. Just the thought of, excuse me, I'm keep bringing up saying the F word, so y'all don't like the fact that I curse. You know, these energies sometimes take me there, and I usually don't speak that way. But they're concerned <laughs> about you coming back around. It's somebody. Holy Spirit, please clarify the concern cards and the nine of swords here. Look at here. They're concerned about, I feel like some of you may say yes. The mature woman is saying to me, I thought I got rid of him or her. Concern card, Holy Spirit. In the nine of swords. Healing. Okay. So this person is concerned the fact that you're not going to be heartbroken anymore because your ex is going to come back in and mend the wounds. Okay. They're not going to do what I'm seeing here. They are not going to do um, what they have done before. They're not going to rewrite this story. This person realized that without you, you know, you were a lost Gemini. judgment here in reverse in the justice card here I'm getting that this is the energy of this woman this older woman she just don't want this to happen it's the healing process here the fear of the unknown is it going to work Look here, lovers, you showed up, Gemini. The three of pentacles here in reverse and the queen of pentacles. This person wants to be invested in you and they don't want you to go nowhere. Look how you got the ten of cups here. They realized making you an option back in the day did not cause them happiness and you walked away, which got them in the nine of swords here again. You was the missed opportunity. Look, it's the same freaking cards. I can't make this up. It wasn't patient with you. But I feel like this person going to come in. They came in with toxic. Okay. This person's going to come in. They're going to come in correct this time. Oh, Gemini. Let me see how you feel about this person. Regarding Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus, how do Gemini feel about their ex? Holy Spirit. Hold on. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Holy Spirit, how does Gemini feel about their ex? I will stop shuffling when Spirit tell me to. King of Wands, the Eight of Coins here in reverse, and the Moon card. This is in reverse. I'm getting a sense that some of you want to work on this. The Five of Swords here, yeah. Some of you want to reconcile with this person, but you're very afraid. The anxiety. It's like you got the king of wands here, and here's the queen of wands. I feel like if you do this, you're going to take it really slow. Yep, the seven of wands. You're going to have your guard up. There's going to be some tears. The six of swords. Tears, crying. Yep, the lover's card. The two of cups. Yeah. Some of you are going to take this offering. But this is going to be, um, you have the passion. Both of you have the passion for each other because you got the queen of wands here and got the king of wands here. And here's the courtship. Okay? Take your time. Take your time. 
But I do feel when this ex come back, they're going to come back right. And somebody mammy mad. Somebody mama mad that you that this person going to offer you to be their wife or the son is going to, you know, however, vice versa, whomever it is, that this mature woman, this, yeah. Cry it out. Y'all gonna put y'all shit on the table and y'all gonna make this work, I feel. But this energy here, I feel like this is her. Because this person here has ties to a son or daughter that they just won't let go. They are a single mother and they're fucking miserable. You would think that she's dating the son or the daughter or however this go. This is keeping this person up at night. That's what I feel. That's the energy of the cards, okay? So I am K-Star Moon Life. After likes, comment, and share. Um, remember, every ending is a beautiful beginning. And I will see you guys next time, Gemini.